What is going on everybody? So today, I never actually thought I'd be making this video. I'm gonna be completely honest with you. Now, the 435 is completely stock. Well, not necessarily. Uh, I actually reverted back to stock on my tune. So I no longer run MHD stage two, and I'll get into that in just a second. So I no longer have MHD, but it remains installed. Um, and what I mean by that is the software is still on the ECU. Uh, so if I ever want to remap, I totally can. It's definitely something I could do. The thing is, is I'm probably not going to do that. I'm going to get into why I reverted back to stock. I know many of you are going to be probably pretty confused. I totally get it. Uh, it's like, why? Like, why would you go back to stock, you know? And honestly, I'm going to be completely upfront about it. Um, I'm just tired of dealing with stuff, man. Like, I, it's one thing after another, and it just builds up. You have to spend all this money, right? You got to do, you know, your ignition coal, spark plugs, injectors. That's a different story. That's just typical maintenance that you'd have to keep up with um, with these cars. Uh, but running a, a tune and all that kind of stuff obviously puts a lot of stress on your car. You know, you got the fuel pumps to worry about. You got a bunch of stuff that you got to keep in mind when you tune these cars. Um, and honestly, like tuning, it's not as easy as you think it would be like, yeah, throw it on. Sure. Whatever. But there's a lot of stuff you got to keep up with. And the problem is with this is I've spent, there's a lot of money that's been invested into this car, uh, maintenance wise. And at this point, I just don't think it's worth trying to, I personally, like my opinion, I just don't think it's worth it. If I like the tune enough, I totally would. I totally would replace the fuel pumps, everything like that. But the thing is, personally, I just don't think it's worth it. Um, and especially on the stock tune, uh, the stock tune runs phenomenally. Forgot how smooth and how linear, excuse me, how linear the mapping was. Just to show you guys, no, I'm not stock um, motor-wise. And many of you probably are gonna be like, well, how how did you revert to the stock map? Like you, you can't run the three and a half bar sensor. You can't, well, so the thing is with MHD is they give you the ability. Uh, I got the team app installed, you know, the three and a half bar sensor in there. So I had to click the three and a half bar option on MHD, which I did completely fine. Obviously for the catted downpipe, I had to choose option where um, it's not OEM. Um, so yeah, I did that. Car runs beautifully. Uh, seriously, I don't know what the deal was. Uh, with the tune so here's the thing i had been running mhd on this car this is mhd stage two on this car the 435 and at first it was fine everything was good and later down the line like probably a month ago it started to like the car started to feel really really odd um i kept having like fuel cuts and a bunch of other crap like it just wasn't running how i wanted it to i reverted to the stock map and lo and behold, it ran perfectly fine. Don't let it scare you away from anything. I had my fair share of experiences uh, with MHD and I think it's time to just move on. Uh, I, like seriously, I, I don't know what it is. It's sad, like it's, it's really sad. Running the stock map, it's just, it's like a peace of mind. Like it's so much better. And I know my car's not working as hard, you know, I don't have to worry about the fuel pumps. Obviously they could still break. Uh, but not as fast. I just reflashed and the car felt perfectly fine. So I'm gonna leave it that way. <laughs> like, it might sound lame, but like, I'm tired. Like, I'm just done with dealing with all this stuff. And it's just a, it's like a peace of mind thing. Um, it really is. I, you know, it's fun to be able to romp on the car. It being stock tune wise, still plenty fast. It's still super fun. Um, and I have no complaints about the stock tune whatsoever. Yeah, tune's done, I'm over it. Uh, so if y'all wanna buy, uh, if y'all wanna buy my little cord that I have, this little thing, I have this little doodad right here. So if y'all want this, hit me up. Um, I'd be glad to sell it to you for cheap. Uh, I believe these are only like 50 bucks new, so. Y'all let me know, what should I do? Like what, what else besides like a splitter and wheels? Let me know in the comments. I hope each and every one of you guys enjoyed this video as always. Drop me a like if you enjoyed. Um, really helps me out a lot. Make sure you subscribe if you haven't already because I upload pretty frequently. Thank you guys for watching as always and we'll see you in the next one.